here to go fishing on these pylons that are out here and the reason we're, we're here rather than the creek or the lake or anywhere else is because there's a front coming in with like 40 mile an hour winds that are going to be blowing in the wind direction that it's going to be blowing we can be protected by these big concrete walls for the most part on another pylon in the middle of the river channel but we got the kayak we got minnows we're ready to go but I drug this thing down here 200 yards so it's getting a little warm, even though it's a little chilly out today, but look at all of this fog. I mean, it is so foggy. It just looks like white out there and it's gonna be awesome. There's nobody out here and I am ready to go fishing. So let's do it. <laughs> got this these minnows and I've got one little bitty hook I can't remember what size that is if it's a four or what but they're small enough that I feel comfortable with a minnow on there and catching them even the 10 inchers so we we'll might have a better hookup rate if we use this size hook I like to hook them through the eye that's just personally how I like to do it all right I'm gonna drop this minnow down there see if anybody's home I'm just gonna go all the way to the bottom We got something here. We got something finally. What we got? Oh man. Whoa, that sucker's pulling. Is this catfish? What is this? Oh my god. Oh my gosh. They're here. Oh my gosh. That is a beautiful crappie. Wow, that sucker was pulling. All right, well, man, look at the big old mouth on that thing. All righty then. We got our first keeper. I am curious just how long this thing is. Oh, man. That is a good 14 incher. Will it even, it won't even fit. When they don't fit, you know you got a good one. I mean, it's a half inch from the mouth right there. Good. That is a big old slab. And he's stuck in there. Oh, we need to get back up in there. I don't know if that crappie came out from under those pylons or if he was just out here swimming around I have no idea hopefully we catch a couple more and kind of figure out where they may be located at but we lit, caught that thing literally right there so they might be on this side as opposed to this other side we were fishing oh there's a brush pile down there or something That's what it is. There's a brush pile. Ha 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 ha. I see now, I see. God, whatever that is, hopefully that's a crappie. 
oh man it's big whatever it is oh it is big oh my gosh what is this what do i have oh it's behind the kayak oh i gotta push off come back out here oh no don't frame a line oh it's a catfish ha that's hilarious What's that, buddy? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Barely even got him. That's cool to catch a cat, at least. Let's go try it up shallow. Let's go to this pylon over here and see if we can float down the edge of it, maybe, and pick one off. I got something. I don't know if I'm hungry. That's a fish. It's a fish. What do I have? Oh my gosh. What do I have? Is that a big old bass or a catfish? Another catfish? Bass. <laughs> That's awesome. That dude hit it like, like a freight train. Come on up here. Not a bad sized bass either. <laughs> uh, you just never know what you're gonna catch. Oh, and you got that hook good, bud. Dang. I need the pliers on you. Oh, and you broke my hook. Oh, well, that is one chunky bass for how small his mouth is. Thanks, buddy. Holy crap. Why? Why? Golly. Well, I put the kayak back up on top of here on these rock gabions from the water, but we caught one crappie and unfortunately I don't have any of the defizzing stuff or anything because I caught him so deep. But I'm going to go home and make some fish tacos. It's a good sized fish. I didn't actually measure it, but when we put it in that little bump board for finding out what regulation size crappie could be, this thing didn't even fit all the way, so it's got to be a 14, 15 inch crappie, but I make a good little sandwich. But it was a good day out here. I don't even know how I caught that fish because it was off those brush piles, off that pylon on this other side, and none of the others would hit. I know there had to be more crappie in there. We did catch that catfish and that bass. I don't know, is it that time of the year? I haven't fished this place in months i just really don't know about the river right now but if i had a fish finder or anything like that i guarantee i probably could have at least found some more schools of those crappie probably but i don't know i'm just assuming that but thanks for watching you guys and subscribe if you haven't already like this video if you liked it and i'll see you guys in the next one